you guys and welcome back to the vlog. My name is Paloma and I am currently playing Elle Woods in a Legally Blonde production. Today is a big day. We are going to be having our marketing photo shoot where we are going to be getting marketing assets to help promote the show. I just hopped out of the shower. Now I'm getting ready. Today I have the opportunity of stepping into one of my costumes that I will actually be wearing on stage as well as the wig and like putting it all together. I'm really having the immersive experience of like, oh my gosh, this is what it potentially could really look like. This might be exactly what I'm wearing. This might be exactly how my hair is done as well as makeup. And I can promise you that moment when everyone puts on their costume, it just feels so much more real. And it's like, oh my God, this is like really happening. So I'm really looking forward to stepping into that character today and starting to see everyone in their costume. It's gonna be so exciting. I'm so excited. I'm actually gonna be testing out how I'm gonna be doing my makeup for the show. That first taste of seeing if everything works. Little rumor has it that me and Bruiser have like a matching bedazzled outfit together. So I'm hoping maybe, which fingers crossed, that is the top I'm gonna to be wearing today for the shoot so I can show you she bedazzled that herself put the wig on step into those pink heels and be like okay here we go let's get some cute photos for this show like we love a photo shoot wanted to note some things from our makeup gal she said I would love basic stage foundation as well as neutral browns and champagne shadows with a touch of black liner and lashes load up on the blush and bronzer since you are a Malibu queen obvi and for the lips a nice rosy pink slash red so we can still get that L vibe without losing your beautiful face on stage Excellent. I think I'm gonna just do this right here, this really nice gold, a pink lip, and just like make my cheeks really, really pink as well. This is a tried and true color that I know looks good on me. Today, since we are actually gonna be taking the photos, I think I'm not gonna like dive deeply into this. Let me show you my palette. I'm really excited about this. I recently bought this palette from Amazon and it is so sparkly and pigmented that I'm looking to use this for the show, although it might be a bit too much for today's photo shoot because again, it's really so pigmented. I don't wanna show up with too much and then we have to remove it because again, we have to do photos today. So this is something that I'm gonna pack in my bag and I'm just gonna like gradually add on and then I can show the makeup artist and she can approve it. And maybe when I get to tech, I can try it out for some days and see how it looks on stage. But I'm really looking forward to this palette. Like I'm obsessed with this one. I I will put it in the link below. Okay, I came over here to the natural light so you can really see how sparkly these things are and look at how it looks when it goes on. Are you seeing that? It is so pigmented, like. Look at that. What I do today is not viable, will probably change it, but it's just really nice to take like that first stab at it. And before I start doing my makeup, I think I'm just gonna have a little stretching session because the dance rehearsals have not stopped and I have not stopped moving my body. And oh. <laughs> What today was, was something I could not have expected. It was actually a lot of tumbling, cartwheeling, splits, lifts and dips and basket tossing involved. Obviously this was the very first day of dance rehearsal and a lot of ideas and a lot of things are being spit out. So like it's a lot of, a lot of everything. The choreographer was like, okay, Elle, you are going to be in the air. So today we are going to practice doing that good stuff. So I am completely like full, like using this muscle right here. Like as I'm actually doing that with my arm, like I can feel the tightness of here because there's a moment where I'm like lifted into the air like this, as well as flat back and Spun, lots of tricks, lots of stuff, tried out a lot of things. <laughs> the choreographer asked me and was like, can you do a cartwheel? And I was like, yes. And he was like, can you do a cartwheel into the splits? And I was like, yes. So he added that to the choreo and oh my goodness. I was asking the assistant choreographer like, is there something I can do to like work out this part right here? Because I need to have that really sturdy and strong. He's like, do planks, do push-ups, but don't get too crazy. I don't want you like, Swole, and I was like, oh yeah, see all L like all snatched, which honestly is impossible because I have such noodle arms. So I definitely need to get on the planks and the push ups because I have to be like, time for my cross. Now lift me. I was really bad with lunch today. I think my stomach was just like so adrenaline and like we were just doing so much. By the time the lunch break came, my stomach was like, your adrenaline is like sky high. All you want, all my body was craving was like water. So I was like sucking on a squeezy and really trying to get some food down because I didn't even want to like touch my Subway sandwich. which was so, so sad. <laughs> it's all of it, all of it. I tried to sit on the toilet this morning. <laughs> my thighs are on 
fire. It definitely is a bummer that I don't have my false lashes on, but I, again, am gonna be waiting till it gets closer to tech to put those on. So today, I think rather than just doing plain mascara, I'm actually gonna be putting on my falsies like the from the same pack that I wore to auditions slash callbacks. I need to stretch. By the way, this is just noting, not complaining. I am not complaining about the pain. I love the pain. It feels like I am working and getting stronger and it reminds me of like the feeling that my body used to get when we were in shows and it just feels so, feels good. I am still having the time of my life and I'm still pinching myself every single day and waking up like, is this actually happening? And just uh, sinking in that gratitude. Oh. Oh my gosh, it hurts so bad. What's this called? This is my calf. This is this is my ham. This is my hamstring. <sighs> Honestly, it's like this muscle right here that I engage. That's so painful. And as I was showering, look. I do have to give the disclaimer that I do bruise easily, but let me tell you, I am definitely with the proof of the dance calls. I just curled my lashes. I do need glue. I hope this is enough glue. The glue that I use has aloe in it and I get I get this one from Amazon. I need to order more glue actually. There's actually a bunch of basic stuff that I need to order now that I'm in a show. I need to get a bald cap that has to be on my list. Today I'm gonna just braid my hair and stick it under the wig because I don't have a bald cap on me. I have it in like my dance bag, but that's like at my parents' house. So don't have a bald cap today. I think I'm just gonna braid it and shove it into the wig. Lashes went on, yay. I just used the last, last bit of the eyelash glue. So I have got to make a list. Eyelash glue, bald cap. I need to get more Grethers pastilles and I can get like a bulk package on Amazon. So I'm gonna get that there. And I need to get a big, big jug of honey from Costco so I can keep filling up like my little honey. I just have to get like all the stuff that like I use all the time for the shows. And I know that my musical theater bag that's usually stuffed with all the essentials like is not stocked. I have not been in a show for so long that I don't have the necessities. I wish I knew how to French braid so I could really get like a tight, tight, tight braid for the wig like all the way from up here but i am not talented and i yet i have definitely tried to teach myself i have watched so many youtube videos this is not as tight as i would like it because again i have to put on a wig and we want this as flat as possible and i just have so much hair and it's so fluffy go like this and flatten this out and then put my wig cap on when I get it for the show, of course. Today, I'm just going to try to flatten this out as much as possible and then toss that wig on. <sighs> okay. All right, guys, it's time to go. I'll see you at rehearsal. Mm -hmm.